are Geek Remedy. Hello. And today we are opening the Doki Doki for July 2016 with theme... Festival. Festival! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. And this one is supposed to have items from Gutedama, Sum Sum, and Hirakuma. So these are three characters and franchises uh, in Japan that I really, really like. So I have really high hopes for this box. So let's see. Let's see how it goes. Da, 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 da. The magazine this month is really different. It's kind of like a drawn sketch. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's so cool. it's really nice. It looks like it has potential. What do you think? Of okay. course. First thing that we have <laughs> is our Hopechan for the month from the company uh, Sonseki Japan. And it's really, really cute. It's a little yellow Hopechan wearing a little <laughs> blue sunglasses. Oh man, it's so cute. So next we have something that says kawaii on it. Um, yeah, so it's a little bag. So this is called Omamori. Omamori is a huge part of Japanese culture. Oh, it's an amulet. These amulets are bought at local shrines for good luck. Your Omamori features an exclusive Doki Doki and some Hoseki design with Hopechan and friends. For more info about Omamori, check out our blog at blog.japancray.com. Okay, so I'm guessing we have a little frog here that we, wa we have to put in the little bag and that's gonna be for good luck. So we have a little, little, tiny, little <laughs> frog here. The word for frog, kaeru, has the same pronunciation as the Japanese word return, change, or go back. Thus, fuku kaeru, fortune frog, can also mean fortune is returned. Therefore, we wear a small frog, which made by wood and earth as good luck charm. All right, so next we have this, which looks like a towel again. I don't want towels. Oh, okay. <laughs> Well, okay, so this is nice. This is a Rilakuma towel. Oh, it's cute. Yeah, it's a little bear, I believe. I like bears. And it's a uh, original Sanrio product, but I don't like, this is the second time they put a towel in the box and I'm tired of towels already. Don't give us towels anymore. <laughs> <gasps> Ooh, I like this. This is a hair tie with a watermelon slice oh, on that's it. that's cool. Okay, so this is nice. So you put this in your hair and then you have a slice of watermelon. <laughs> so I like this. You would look you would like nice. I would look gorgeous. Gorgeous, of course. Next we have, oh, is that a fan? We have a fan produced by Sun Hoseki Japan, which is again the company that they work with for Hopechan and all the other things. This is a, a Hopechan fan. It's really nice. nice. I like it. It's quite useful right now because it's <laughs> yes. really, really warm. Do you want to pick the next one? Yes, this. This. What is this? It's a what? fish. What is this? Oh, it's so cute. Oh, he has a leaf. It's a leaf. a leaf on his head. You're it's... a strange fish, sir. Whoa. Oh, okay. So every month now Doki Doki has a, an exclusive plush. So this is it. Uh, oh. This month we have two new additions to our exclusive Doki Doki plushie line. Meet Kiko and Wawa, the cutest bear in the pond. Learn more about the orange life-like fish and the fish-like lemon nah. on page 8. Okay, so we got the orange one and the orange one's name is Kiko. Then we have, oh, we have a little pouch with a bunch of Hopechan stickers. I think no. I think those are tattoos. They're tattoo stickers. At summer festivals, you can often find a booth that offers temporary tattoos with these 10 like sheets of stickers tattoos. You can easily enjoy some kawaii body art just like in Japan. So we got a ton of different tattoos of, oh my God, they're all Hopechan. There's cat Hopechan, star Hopechan, bunny Hopechan, chocolate Hopechan, cake Hopechan, raindrop Hopechan. There's a bunch of different ones. Okay, so next we have this. Oh, it's a little um, Gapachan with, oh, that's cute. It's a little ice cream cone to put on oh, your nice. keychain, on the ball chain. I, I like, like this that. one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's, it's, it's Gutetama. Oh, it's the guy that's so lazy. Yeah, what is this? Oh, it's a clip. Like, it's a clip, so you can put it like on a bag of chips or something. Oh, so it's, cool. it says here, Gutetama Kitchen Clips. Gutedama is the world's laziest egg, but he knows he has to be useful to avoid being eaten. As a handy clip, he has many uses and come from with a magnet to stick to surfaces. Okay, so what's next? <gasps> next we have, we have a, a Tsum Tsum blind bag. This is awesome. Yay. Okay, these are definitely from Japan because we do not have these boxes here. Our Tsum Tsum come in like little blind bags here. And this one is a blind box. 
So it looks like you can get one of eight designs. There is Silly, Mike Wazowski, Bullseye from Toy Story, Buzz, Jesse, or Lotso the Bear, Woody, and the Alien Guy. <gasps> I think we got Buzz. Oh, we got Buzz! Oh, nice! Look at this little Tsum Tsum! Oh my god, this is so exciting. <laughs> oh, he's winking! He's funny. <laughs> oh, we got a cute little Buzz Tsum Tsum. That's awesome. Oh! Oh, he's squishy. He's not that the Tsum Tsum we have here. He's squishy. Then we see, we have... Oh, no. <laughs> okay, so what is this? Let's open this. It's a Ten Nugui, I think. A Ten Nugui are traditional Japanese towels. Oh, again with the towels. <laughs> <laughs> Why so many towels? Another towel. They're very pop popular at summer festival as, they as they're used to absorb sweat. And performer performers wear them as protection from bulky helmets and masks. Oh, and it, there's Mount Fuji. This is Mount Fuji on Oh, here. that's cool. Yeah, that's nice. I like that. But the reason I was like, oh, no, it's because there's another towel. <laughs> that's oh, can you piece? have three? Yes, this is a little towelette for like your face or something. It's like a handkerchief. <laughs> oh, but they gave us one last time and we had three towels in this one. That's a lot. Yeah, that's a towel fit. Yeah, that's like, ah, oh, another one. I hope they're not going to make this a regular thing. Yeah, it's the fan? same design as on the fan. All right, so this is it for the July 2016 uh, with Theme Festival. I have to say that they really did a good job with keeping the theme this month because everything looks very like festival, like tattoos, like towels, and um, I, I really, really Maybe like not buzz. it. <laughs> Maybe not like yeah, but like I'm He's really the I'm really happy that they brought Tsum Tsum in. So I think this was stronger than last month. I'm very annoyed at the three towels. I think three <laughs> is a little excessive. One, two, three. This is quite a lot. Um, but I think my favorite item was the Tsum Tsum. I really like the the little the fish. fish. Yeah, the fish is nice as well. I think I'll call him George as well. We have multiple Georges now. <laughs> Miss Kitty is looking Miss at Kitty it like Miss Kitty is hearing the little songs <laughs> like. What is this? <laughs> Thanks you guys for watching. Let us know in the comments section below what you thought of the Doki Doki crate this month. Is it better than the one from last month with the street fashion Harajuku style box? Mm -hmm. Go please check out our channel and click on other kawaii videos that you might like. Uh, like this video, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye! Bye.